Hey Virgi Virgi, hey Virgos, how y'all doing? It's Gira Ruth. Welcome to Manifesting New Moon. Yes, today, yesterday, we're manifesting. Okay, first off, what are you grateful for? Grateful for my life, I'm grateful for people in my life, my family, friends, grandbabies, um, friend, neighbors, the whole world, the whole universe, people that help me out in so many ways through life online wherever it may be uh strangers just the whole nine yards just so grateful so we are grateful for and our money manifestation stop uh never stop attracting manifesting money wealth abundance and keep it protected keep flowing in our hands excellent healing okay so yeah see my little froggy back there a good look okay and also happy birthday to mr tesla i didn't notice that until i was pulling these cards and for aries and uh you know i how you know how i feel about tesla i don't know if y'all do or not but i'm just obsessed with him he's so brilliant to me it says uh nikola tesla is super awesome he is the electrical genius who came up with, with altering current and remote controls he feuded with Thomas Edison, who badmouthed him and electrocuted elephants in his name. Ain't that something? You got to pay for that. Tesla spoke eight languages, had a photographic memory, and slept only two hours a night. He died while trying to invent a death ray. See? One on at midnight, 9th, 10th, July. Okay. Genuine humanitarian. Are you? You're on your mission to do what you need to do, Virgie? Mm, okay. So I got my incense going. I got the myrrh. I got the um, frankincense. Oh, my goodness. I did not put on um, the aromatherapy. Yeah, so I put my frankincense and pomegranate in there. Keep our look going, y'all. And Florida water. Okay. Uh-oh. So, yeah, we're manifesting here. Repeat positive affirmations about enlightenment and spiritual connections. Uh, affirmations for enlightenment. My enlightenment is right here and right now. Today I am awakening to possibilities I never considered before. The pearls of my awakening are scattered along my path today. I am awakening from a sleep of my confusion. I am a vehicle for rising the vibration of this planet. I am healed. And here as well. So crown chakra, I got a crown chakra uh, incense. And to open it, because we need that for manifesting, to receive from the divine. Be quiet, meditate, expand your mind. Books or podcasts helps create a great gratitude practice. Okay, hello. So the first one we're going to do is uh, medical affirmations. Okay, Let's see what they're saying. Being grateful, okay? Letting go of all that craziness. Don't serve us anymore. We're in a new world. New world order. New world. We're in Aquarius age. Totally different. Look it up. Uh, okay, I don't know how this got in there. What do they do? Probiotics help send food through your gut. By affecting nerves that control gut movement. Irritable bowel syndrome, inflammatory bowel disease, IBD, infections, diarrhea caused by viruses, bacteria, probiotics, bowel bacteria can ease the symptoms of irritable bowel syndrome, IBS, and other conditions. Um, yeast. Probiotics help fight diarrhea and other digestive problems. Maybe you needed that. I don't know. I don't know how they got in that court. I am not sneaky. I don't say doubtful things. I don't need cigarettes to smoke for company all the time. I can sit and do other things. I don't lie to myself. I am not a hoarder or messy. It's memories control. I don't take everything personally. Jokes, criticism, I learn and laugh at myself. Fight to think positive today against your brain your brain and people. Okay, hello. 
Now we got uh, affirmations of truth. Letting go of all that old crap, right? Forgiving yourself. So manifestation can come on through. You know? Don't let nobody stick you there either. I am not lazy. I know I don't know everything, but I am wise and knowledgeable. I am good with money. I am not a snitch. I am not a thief. I don't talk just to talk. I have something to say. I always manifest what I want. I don't need to gamble. I am not hooked. I am not nosy. I don't follow the latest trend. I ask for directions when I need to. Hello. Okay. So I found these cards, y'all, when my trip to Austin last weekend. And they're actually uh, postcards, but I thought they were pretty cool. Let's see which one comes out for you. Spurgy Birdie. Okay, we got this one came to the side. We got the same thing as uh, Leo got, I think, the crow. Okay, so the crow, let's see what the crow symbolizes, okay? Okay, the crow symbolizes transformation and change. Hello, there are watchful creatures that have a sharp and powerful foresight. You can tap into the potent power of this bird to transform the bad into, fores into foresight or something useful. The crow represents change or transformation. The spiritual, uh-oh. Uh, this phone, I tell you. Okay, um, represents, like we say, transformation, destiny, intelligence, fearlessness, mystery, adaptability, and higher perspective, as well as bearing some negative associations and manipulations and mischief. Okay, so accept your dark with the good, because dark is mostly better. Because it's transformation showing you how to go to the next level. Okay. Okay, let's do these little cards that I made, y'all. See what they want to say. I clear all that. Get what we need. Can't stay stuck. That's a lot. Okay, we got two. It says uh, magic. Okay. Uh oh, sorry. You birth creation, sky, sun, moon, stars, universe. When you eat the right foods, stay, stay makes foods, makes you healthy. The waste comes out of you. Magic. Okay. Hello. So maybe you need to eat right. Okay. Uh, are you balancing your feminine and masculine side? Y'all should be able to do that. So that should be easy for y'all. Are you getting enough sleep? Okay. Questions on the table, Bergie. So we're going to do the last shock of wisdom, and I'm going to let y'all go. Okay. Third chakra, solar plexus, oneness and unity. I accept the oneness of all life, and I know I am one with all others on this journey. I support them and let them support me. I am brave and not afraid to ask for assistance. I allow myself to empathize, empathize and sympathize with others, and I choose to see the love in all around me. I see, I see everything as part of my own life, and I accept others for who they are. I find common ground with others rather than differences, as this brings harmony into my life and into theirs. Hello. 
But that's what I have for you, Virgie, Virgie. I guess we can do a little uh, edible. Maybe uh, they already showed you something you needed at first. Maybe. Maybe somebody needed that. So let's see. Magnolia tree and the flowers. Leaves can be dried and sprinkled into food and spread on ginger uh, for short cooking salads. Let's see what it is uh, also for. Okay, what's the health benefits? Uh, essential oils relieve constipation, discomfort, monthly cycles, diffuse crushes and aromatherapy. Okay. And can eat raw. Okay, let's see what else it does. Uh, used for weight loss, digestion, constipation, anxiety, stress, depression, fever, headache, stroke, asthma, flower blood. Use it for stuffy nose, runny nose, cold, sinus pains, hay fever, headache, facial dark spots. Okay, make us a tea. Make know your bark, okay? So make sure you research that before you try it, okay? All right, Virgie, that's what I have for you. This is your girl, Ruth, signing off. Would you like, subscribe, share, and comment? I really appreciate it. And until next time, talk to y'all later, okay? Manifest. And if it's it been helping with the manifestations we've been doing, if it's been helping you, I would like to know in the comments if you don't mind because it's really been helping me. All right, love y'all. Bye.